everyone, welcome to Vagar University. In this video, we will learn how to add and manage resources. Resources are perfect to prevent any overbookings and allowing them to be reserved when an appointment is booked. Let me show you how it works. From the calendar screen, we will hover over settings and click into service and class menu. Once loaded, I will find and select my service that I will be assigning a resource to. To the left of the details loaded, I will see a resource dropdown. A service can be assigned multiple resources. This is perfect for interchangeable rooms. So if Studio A is booked, the service can still be hosted in Studio B or C. For this service, I will be adding in a studio office room that is used for virtual consultations. I will click Add Resource and input my details. Once added, I will reopen the drop-down menu and ensure it is selected and click Save on the bottom right. Another way to manage resources would be to click the Resource tab on the top left. This is where you can add and manage existing resources. You can add in your details and simply click into Add. If needed, you can also delete resources from the screen. Keep in mind that you would still need to assign them into your service like I had done previously to the consultation service. Once your resources are added, you could begin booking and reserving them. I'll quickly add a service with the resource onto Emmanuel's calendar at 2.30. Now if I try to add a service using the same resource onto John's calendar, it will populate an alert stating that the resource has been taken. Resources can be a variety of items, whether it's a room, chair, or even equipment that cannot be shared. For more helpful tips and tricks, click the Vagar University link in the description below.